both Nam Myoho Renge Kyo and Namu Myoho Renge Kyo are closely related phrases used in Buddhist chanting, particularly in the context of Nichiren Buddhism. While they are very similar, there is a slight difference in pronunciation, and the choice between the two may depend on regional variations or specific sects within Nichiren Buddhism. In essence, both forms of the phrase serve the same spiritual purpose, and the difference lies primarily in the pronunciation and regional or sect-specific variations. Nichiren Buddhists may choose one form over the other based on tradition, personal preference, or guidance from their specific community or teacher. Regardless of the pronunciation, the core of the practice and its meaning remain consistent. The word Namu is a term derived from Sanskrit and is commonly used in various forms of Buddhism. In Sanskrit, the term Namas means devotion. When this term is translated into other languages, such as Japanese, in the case of Nichiren Buddhism, it becomes Namu. In the context of chanting Namu Myoho Renge Kyo, Namu is an expression of deep reverence and devotion to the Lotus Sutra and its teachings, as well as a declaration of faith and commitment to the principles of Nichiren Buddhism. It signifies a profound act of devotion and submission to the profound truth and wisdom represented by the Lotus Sutra, and is an essential component of the practice for many Nichiren Buddhists. The choice between Nam and Namu is a matter of tradition and practice rather than a question of correctness. Both forms are valid and serve the same purpose of expressing deep reverence and devotion to the Lotus Sutra and its teaching in Nichiren Buddhism. If you are a practitioner, you can follow the pronunciation and tradition that aligns with your specific community or teacher's guidance.